Good evening and welcome back once again. We had a very strong performance in the last match, 4-1 win, and we're now away to Elche. Mudrik is still out injured. Let's just jump into the lineups to see who will be playing. So we are dropping Omaragic out because he needed a rest anyway and he's on a downward red, so that just coincides. So Balbuena and Costner will be in the centre. The newest wingbacks, Baca and Emerson playing. Mariba, Cousins and Vieira are the middle three with Xerxes, Arcas and Carlos Perez being the front three. And a number of fixtures being played pretty much back to back now. So rotation is going to be key as always, but more so in these um, early days in December. Would have loved to play Castro again, but we need to rotate. Xerxes is a very good player. I'd love to get Mudrick back in the next match if he's fit. Still injured at the moment. It's three games he's missed. It was a terrible challenge that injured him. Good header, but it uh, doesn't frame one of our players, but it's more like it. the best of passes to Xerxes. Ah, uh, Vieira couldn't quite find the way through. Cousins was very good in the last match. He, uh, he did get a goal, but he could have scored a couple. He hit the post at one point as well. Seem to get the ball back though, no matter what we do. Yeah, it's one of those. I, I don't really like using the term scripted, but one of those moments where kind of doesn't seem no matter what you do, the ball is just going to keep finding the opposition. Got it back now though. Back on the charge, but he gets caught out. Hit Xerxes, I think that shot. Not really getting the look at not everything's bouncing the wrong way. Ah, come on. Just fell over there. I wish you could turn these replays off for the uh, really boring ones at that, but there's no need for like really not a bad challenge, it's just a, a free kick in the middle of the park. No yellow card or anything. Ah, it's poor. Come on, Xerxes, you've got to do better than that. Runs it back, though. Xerxes again. Perez, Xerxes. 1 0. What a move and finish that was. Had to take it first time. Nice play by Vieira. And a little bomb too, but look at this. Just had it, but well he just poked it almost, didn't he? I tried to take a touch that was either going to run out of play or the keeper would get it. Yep, yeah, absolutely lovely. To be honest, we've been pretty average up until that point. We've been giving the ball away. We haven't really been able to get the ball back quickly enough. We've given the opposition be way more possession than we would want especially in the attack third but that's what we can do when we uh, put it together properly that's oh, offside come on Xerxes 
definitely offside. Yeah, way offside that. That's going to be offside, isn't it? I'm sure that was offside. I was actually looking at the line because there wasn't much I could do when it got to that point. And he looked at least a foot offside. Never mind, he missed it in the end. Yeah, we haven't been that solid today, though. Croissants. Yeah, right. not much space. Oh, nice ball to Emerson. Oh, Xerxes nearly got on the end of it. Now we air it. Croissants again. Croissants. Nah. Too many defenders in the way. Oh, nice header. What's that? What is that? It's a free kick somehow, even though I shot and they cleared it. And there was no tackle. They were going to clear it anyway, so it's pretty much the same. But it seems to be worse for them. Nice play by Vieira. Xerxes in here. Arcas, oh, oh. I think I overplayed that really. Oh, and Mariba should have scored. Yeah, I think I should have just went for goal with Xerxes. Nice tackle off. Well, it was a nice tackle from Backer, but the uh, play got it back straight away. Good interception. And a nice ball to Perez. Now is there anyone overlapping? That's a foul. That's an absolute blatant shove. I'm probably going to get a yellow card for that. Yeah. Absolute idiot of a referee. Sorry, I'm just adjusting here. Probably hear lots of noises. That was just frustration. I don't think it was a yellow card, actually, but... How was that not a free kick for us? We were on the way to attack, and we just got absolutely shoved off the ball. Not even going for the ball itself. We've got fouled again there. Did well to keep it. Vieira, no. That's half time, 1 0, well deserved, but it should have been more. And 56% possession, more of the shots. Uh, they did have the odd sort of, well, they had a fair bit of possession in the final third, but didn't create a massive amount. But we didn't play great. I mean, after we scored, it was a very good goal that we scored. We certainly played better after that, but before that, it was. Um, yeah, it was sloppy. We just couldn't retain possession that well where it mattered. I don't know, a bit of a strange performance. That's a weird pass from Marcas. Yes, Goussants. Yera into Xerxes. Lovely turn. Oh, almost a brilliant finish. And that's what Xerxes offers you. He's very good with his back to goal. Look at that turn. Nearly a good finish. Disappointing that I didn't go in just because it was such a good effort by him. You know, him and Castro do offer different things. Xerxes doing well again. Waits for back it. 
Nearly finds its way to one of our players. Good block for Marie, but that could be a chance for a counter. Well, I don't know what happened there. It looked like the pass was going through. Sexy Perez. Oh my word, what a finish. What a finish that was. And we did say in the last match that um, he needs to score a bit more often. Sexy again, back to goal. Nice little layoff, but what a finish that was. The keeper's not going to stop that one. Bam. What a goal. It's a little bit more comfortable now. What's that? Let me guess they're giving a free kick. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Right, we're going to make some changes. We're bringing on Danny Garcia for Mariba, and we're going to bring on Bouchard for Carlos Perez, but we're not going to make that third substitution this time. I thought about leaving Mariba on. I want to give a bit more chance, but like I say, we've got games coming thick and fast, and there's another match in three days, and then what? one about three or four days after that as well. Good block there. Don't know why we're getting a replay of that. Good clearance, and Xerxes does get it. Plays it just simply to Vieira. Now I miss him. I haven't seen too much of him in this game. And he gives the ball away. Gets it back. I thought he got fouled there. He's Bichere. First touch of the ball. And he gives it away. Good tackle from Garcia there. Into back. Jair. Zixi. I actually took my eye off, eye off it there for a second. Not sure what happened. <sighs> Nearly a good pass from Jair. Yeah, the season's going quickly. You know, we're obviously playing a lot of games. We've been in three competitions. But we're already in December. Nice block. And Cousins picks up the pieces. Bouchard. Now Xerxes. To Arcas. Xerxes again. Oh, what a finish. Again, like I say, back to goal. That's where he's most dangerous because he just seems to turn so well. Turn and shoot. See, back to goal. Turns, plays it to Arcas. Gets it back in. There's nowhere to go there. But look at that. Little touch and bam. Don't know why I keep saying bam today when I'm scoring. Little touch. Lovely finish. I think I'm maybe doing Xerxes a bit of a disservice recently because I've been so impressed with Castro and it's quite easy to, when you've got a new player, think, oh, this player's amazing and, you know, it's way better than, you know, the other guy that he's replaced, but that's not the case. You know, Xerxes is just a different player. It's very, very good. I mean, he was our top scorer last season massively. 
and also we built a lot of our play around him, not just his goals, but his actual passing, his hold up play. Like this. So we've got to remember that. And um, we need them both anyway. You know, it's not one or the other. The amount of games that come up, they're going to have to alternate pretty much. Maybe not every single game alternate, but a lot of them. Here's back at. Ooh, nearly got through to Xerxes there. So this is going to be a good corner. Oh, nearly. Ocas just couldn't quite get into it. There's all sorts going on here. People running into each other. What's going on? Somehow they came up with it in the end. Good tackle. And Balbuena just gets onto it. Cousins, Xerxes. Vieira. Ah, uh, just... Didn't have the pace. He's so tired. Our players are shot a little bit. That's offside. I cleared it anyway. And that will be full time when we play it. Very good performance in the end. After a bit of a shaky first half. 56% possession. 9 shots with 5 being on target. And passes. Around about the 1-2-5 mark. Man of the match. Xerxes with Perez being a close second. 100% agree with that. They were the ones on the score sheet. Then the midfield did well in the second half. Backer should have definitely got more than a 5. He was up and down that flank all day. And he offered a lot of support down there. And subs did a good job when they came on too. Agree with that. And good news is that we got a message saying Mudrick is back, so hopefully he will be playing in the next game, assuming he's not on a downward red or anything like that. Playing Villarreal, so join us for that one. Drop a comment down below, hit that like button, and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date. But I'll see you all next time. Cheers.